Welcome back, this is Yamajack, and today we're going to do some more Desolation because we need another 32,197... Uh, dosh. Did I do that math right? I think I did that math right. I think I'm a, I think I'm a god mathematician. About as good as it gets. So I realized I was using a uh, display capture. Which is uh, no good, no good, no good. In fact, it's like super not good because I believe it was actually like cropping the content too. Very slightly, but I believe it was. That was my RuneScape 3 thing, which has a... Uh, um, whatchamacallit? The, uh, the title bar is cropped out. And then it has like a little bit of a black bar on the top and bottom. So I've switched back to the, the KF2... Uh, preset thingy profile thingy I don't know the the scene and uh, we should be good to go microphone still doing great I think I've managed to fix it at this point I think we are good to go at this point I think that I'm using it just fine at this point how else can I say this point <laughs> yeah I haven't been shaving as much lately in the quarantine and it feels bad because the thing about shaving is uh Having facial hair sucks. Right? Having facial hair, no fun. But shaving, also no fun. Like they both, they both bring me a, a, a level of discomfort, right? So it ends up that I, uh, I don't shave until it's at a point where, um, I'm, I'm more uncomfortable by having the facial hair, which is about where it's at now. So I'm probably gonna be shaving today, but I, uh, regardless. I haven't been shaving as much. Kind of been, just in general, doing less. Like, I still clean myself, and I still, you know, not letting myself go necessarily, but just in general, like, less things to care about. Like, I don't put on, like, normal pants. I mean, oftentimes, I don't put on pants, <laughs> you know? Like, I'm not leaving the house anymore. Not often. Oh, yeah! I was going to talk about the, um, I had to go out the other day for, to get my hormones. I mean, I do put on pants when I go out, I do go out often, but like, there'll, there'll be days where, for most of it, I'm, I'm not wearing pants. Because, <laughs> why put on pants? I get up in the morning, maybe make some lunch, you know, or breakfast, depending on what time I wake up at. And then, uh, sit on my computer for a bit, watch TV read you know like not really not really doing anything that requires pants um but anyway, i had to go out to shoppers the other day which is the first time i went out with a purpose uh, shoppers is the, the the local drug mart near me and uh actually how do i pause the recording i need a hotkey for this i didn't give a hotkey but i did end up talking to some people oh no I've like I've taken I've taken the break, and now I can't I can't get back into it. You know, I need to get a hotkey for pausing because I feel like there's there's oftentimes I have I have Discord open, and I have OBS over the the right half of it, so I I can see when people are talking, and most of the time, their text doesn't make it past the point where OBS is covering it up, so I can still read text. I can still read Discord while I'm. Uh, while I'm recording, and then people will say things, and I'll be like, I have input, but I can't do it until I've, uh, I've come back. Most of the time, I don't really care, but sometimes it's time sensitive, you know? This one wasn't, but I, uh, I mean, it was more important <laughs> than recording. Um, let's see. So I want to get a, a hockey for pausing. It doesn't happen often, like I said, but when it does, it's just frustrating, you know? Come on. We're gonna win this round. For, uh, we're gonna win this round, duh. It's only round two. I'm not gonna die on round two. Desolation. It's not that hard of a map. It isn't an easy map, though. Like, I thought it might be a little bit easier than it actually is. It's not really an, an easy map, necessarily. It's not very hard, either. Oh, I jumped at the wrong time there. It's not very hard, but it's not an easy map. 
Um, the corner spawns that they added aren't that bad, so you don't want to go there, you want to go there. I went here, and then, you know, you get trapped in here and you die. Don't do that! I'm not going to do that again. I probably will. But, I'm not going to do it right now. I like this map a lot, though. It's very well designed. It's very vertical, too, is the other thing. Which is interesting, because I don't know any other KF2 maps that are at this vertical. Like, for the most part, KF2 maps are super duper lateral, you know? Like, you don't, you don't often go this far down and then that far up. Like, they're, they're normally like one layer with like maybe a floor or two, right? But this one is... It's got some mad verticality in it. Like, we are probably... What? In the, in the context of other uh, maps, like, we're probably a good five, six, seven floors lower than, uh... It's probably like twice as tall as Outpost, is my guess. Like, it's, it's a tall map. It's really cool. I don't know why they have, like, cargo containers in this thing. If you're gonna add stuff, at least add stuff that makes sense, you know? You're not just gonna park a bunch of stuff in here, it's not. That wouldn't happen. Okay. See ya! You wanna kinda aim, like, just to the left of something with this, which is, uh... A little bit finicky at times, but... I mean, it's not that bad, really. It's a fun weapon. I like the Glock. The Blunderbuss is apparently also really good. On, uh, on support. On demo, you can't carry it with an RPG, so it's garbage. Uh, but on support, it's apparently really good. Because you get, uh, all that piercing and bouncing and... Super high damage. It's apparently super good on support, so we might try that out. Uh, I do own it. I bought both the DLCs. I buy all of the DLCs when they come out because I, uh, if I wasn't doing YouTube, I'm not sure I would. Uh, but it makes for just some more, more content, right? So I feel like it's it's worth it to buy them for the content. Not that I have like issues with making content at this point yet, anyway. But it's like I, I see it as an investment rather than a purchase, you know. Like, I'm, I'm investing in uh, in my channel by buying this, and I don't mind investing in my channel. <laughs> wow. Now you gotta aim a little bit to the left. Like, right here, you're gonna miss, but right here, you're not gonna miss. Right? It's just, just a little bit off to the left is where you wanna go. Just slightly, a few pixels off to the left is is perfect, right? Uh, we see anybody over here? Yeah, we see this guy over here. And it's not as bad as people think. Like you got a tap click, if you just hold it down, it's going to be much much harder. But if you if you're tap firing, like. That. It's actually pretty accurate. If you're holding it down, it's a lot less accurate. But if you're like tap firing, it's, uh, it tends to be a lot, a lot easier. I also haven't checked the audio levels on this. I'm sitting quite a bit farther away from my microphone. I have, I am talking louder, so it should be fine. But I, uh, I am also sitting quite a bit farther away from my microphone, so I'm, I'm a little bit concerned about that. I think it should be fine though. Oh, we can upgrade it twice. Nice! That's sick. That's sick. I love the double upgraded deagles. We are gonna try this one. We're gonna, we're gonna try it. Just because we have an easy way to escape when that inevitably comes to be required. I mean, how are you supposed to defend this? This is just a like big oof defend zone right here. Yeah, see ya. <laughs> That's the extent of what I'm doing there. No, please and thank you. Uh, this isn't where I want to go. I almost did it again. 
Except the other way around. I don't mind being up here. This is an okay spot. I'm not gonna go behind the airplane again because I don't the airplane. Why don't I just call them airplanes? Every time, man. I'm thinking I'm gonna take a picture of like kinda like no clip off there and then take a picture of the, the landing pad maybe. I'm not sure. I mean I can use the official pictures, but I don't uh I don't like that. I like I like doing it myself, you know? Oh, we got a... S no, it's a... Oh, I thought you went through the... I thought you were going to hit the blow. That's unfair, dude. <laughs> Look at that jump rope. Whoa! <laughs> we got... Launched! No such thing as a free launch, but... Certainly, a free launch. Okay, we are behind the uh, the quote-unquote airplane at this point, which is what I said we weren't gonna do, and then immediately we did. Oh no, there's something behind me too. Oh, dear goodness gracious. Okay, this is working. Not working well. I see you. There's a scrake down there. That's okay. I don't mind a scrake. Uh, we're going to take this back up. Where did you come from? Okay, there's a spawn point there. That's okay. Wait, you like slide down that. That's kind of cool. If you just walk off, there's there's this like little bit of a curve on it. So you, uh, you don't take damage, I guess, when you just walk off. That's That's really cool. That's really, really well designed. I like that a lot. Where's the Scrake coming? Yeah, he's right here. Scrake is no big dealio. I think I can just uh, not worry about the recoil and just kind of allow it to, 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 to take me up following the head. It does a pretty okay job of it. Another Scrake and I think another one, yeah. Yeah, kind of just, if you don't handle the recoil, it kind of just follows the head anyway. Like, this is me holding my mouse completely still. Headshotted him. Did not move the mouse at all. So it's not that bad. Um, you kind of want to pull it up a little bit, though, because that was probably an extra shot or two that I used there. Which I didn't have to do. But hey. You know. Microphone's still working. I think I fixed it. Feels good. Can you fit through here? No, you can't even get into that corner there. That's cool. Ooh, I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't like that. That's a no good. Alright, so we're going to be able to fight the boss. This is an easy map for bosses because there's lots of corridors with plenty of space, lots of space to move around, and you can kite pretty easily. Um, honestly, boss fights on this, I don't think we're going to be losing too much. We may. You know, I'm not saying that we'll always win, but I am saying that it's a bit of an easier... A bit of an easier fight. Going to want to not tank the rockets on this one. Even though I maybe... No, definitely couldn't tank it on Hell on Earth. I don't know where he's coming from. And I'm, I'm not liking it. He's outside. He's right here. Alright, let's deagle him up a little bit here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bring it. Bring it, dude. Easy fight. 
easy fight. We took like basically nothing on that. Ah. Gunslinger is mildly overpowered, I guess. All right. 12k dosh. That's what I like to see. That's going to do it for today. Thank you for watching. Remember to like the video if you like it. Subscribe to see more in the future. Comment if you have anything to say. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.